Hi everyone, it's Nona Grace and I'm from Western New York. I hope you're all having a great day. I had a good day chasing chickens. I'm going to share that with you today. I actually found out how Rosie and Andy get out of the fence. Well, it stopped snowing and look who's out where they're not supposed to be. What are you doing? They go through the fence. I found out how they get out. In you go. Come on there, Silver. Let's walk up. The grass is wet, you know. Come on. Start walking. Start walking. You need to get back in. Up. Oh, see how she got in? He got in? That's how they've been getting in. Come on. You can't go through that. That's got a blocking. Let me open the gate. Here. Come back. yoo -hoo. I opened the gate. Go back. Go back, Rosie. Back's over. In you go. In you go. Thank you. Now stay in there. Gee whiz. And the babies can't come out anymore because he put a, a netting here. But one of them got out the other day earlier, and I don't know how it did it. Unless it was right here. No, I don't think so. Can't. How are you trying? Are you trying to look for a way out? You learn to stay in. I don't think there's any more eggs. I already got the eggs today, but I'll look just to make sure. Nope, no eggs. Those are my ceramic eggs. I leave them in there because one day, one of the hens apparently broke an egg open, and I want them not to learn to do that. Good morning there, or good afternoon. Good evening almost, Emma. She's gotten so mellow. She used to puff up as soon as you opened up the door. There's, we do have an electric fence, but apparently it's not strong enough for them to stay in. They keep going, scooting through. And um, when they do it, they don't, they're not walking on the ground. They jump up and scoot through a section where their feet are not touching the ground. So they're, they're basically, they're it's like a, shot. it's like a bird that's on the, on the, on the electric wire. electric wire. They don't get shocked either. They can sit there and and nothing happens to them. Same thing with these little chickies. And then I'm going to show you brownie, and I'm going to show you silver, and I'm going to show you snow. A little bit of snow. Nothing bad. It snowed a little bit, and it, but it was not really sticking, but it was snowing, and I did it. I showed you twice. I'm going to show you also the television was turned on again, and it was on Chromecast. And I'm going to show you how if I turn the television off and turn it back on, it doesn't come to Chromecast. It has a whole nother screen that it goes to. So Sally and George are really playing tricks. And you know, when I was thinking about the television, that's the room that I found my bracelet in that it should have never been in there. And that was the room that the ukulele was supposed to be in and it wasn't in there. And um, so a lot of things have gone on in that room. Now look at Brownie, where she is. Oh, my stars. Stay in, girlies. What are you doing, Brownie? Ooh, there you go. Okay, you stay in here. Okay, baby, you stay too. I gotta shut the gate. Whoa, no, 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 no. You stay in. Okay. Leave the barn door open and the, and the animals will get out. <laughs> oh, they try. Silver, let's get yourself back in. Come on. No, no, no. Oh, 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 it's slippery. Go on. Shoo, shoo. Oh. There you go. Well, the weatherman was right. I don't know if you can see the little snowflakes in the air. It's snowing. It's not really, st well, is it sticking? Well, maybe it's sticking a little. Let me come out here. There's a snowflake. A little, oh, there's a couple more. There's a few snowflakes. They're just sticking slightly. We'll let you see later if it stays around, but it's snowing out. Oh, it's not very nice. The wind's not blowing, but it's snowing. It's still dropping snow. Hello, ladies. I'm not coming out to give you anything. 
I was just going to show that you were all walking back from the pine tree, but I missed it. But it's snowing still. The deck is still kind of not, there's not much on it. It's real fine now. Earlier they were bigger little flakes. Now it's real fine stuff. Vision turned itself on again. On to Chromecast. I'm going to turn it off to show you what really is supposed to come on when you first turn it on. I'm gonna, I've got the remote here and I'm gonna turn it off. Now I'm going to turn it back on. And it should come up with this when you turn it on. It doesn't come up with Chromecast. Then you're supposed to do something. I don't know what you're supposed to do. It's supposed to light up these numbers here, or these letters here, somehow. I don't even know how. It's not doing it. Ugh, now what did I get? I have no idea what, oh, I went to Chromecast. Wow, how did it do that? Hmm. Turn it off again to see what happens. Turned it off, turned it back on. It comes up with that, which is TV. And that's the search button. It's all these other things that I don't even have. At least they're moving today. The other day I couldn't even get them to move. I go up, maybe, oops, up, 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 up. Let's see if we can get over there. Okay, that brought that down. And now I can Chromecast. Let's hope it Chromecasts. Smart cast, it says. Yep, there it is. But it shouldn't come to this when it's turned on. It's supposed to come to that other screen, which is weird that it comes to this screen. Well, that's that for the TV. Thank you, George and Sally. You're making it easier for me to um, find Chromecast because I sure cannot do it. This, this remote is crazy. This remote has a lot of buttons on it that we don't even use. It's got Voodoo, Netflix, Amazon, Kumo, Crackle, and Heart Radio. I don't have any of those things, but it's got them. And we hear, when I hear noises, it's usually upstairs, and I, I always think that the sound is at the room that's above that room. Somewhere in there I hear the sound. And the dog will actually look up when we hear the noise, too. But when we had the foster children, it was in a different room that they used to feel the cold draft. So they've moved. They've decided to go to a different room um, and maybe stock those two rooms. I don't know. The one up above was is my, is my party room. Maybe they like to party. I don't know. <laughs> and the one downstairs is what I call my family room. And so maybe that's what they like, the parties and the family stuff. So that's, I'm going to share that part with you. I also am going to share, I was really surprised today. I was watching a video of Pamela, adorable crocheting, or crochet. And she had showed how to make a washcloth in her next video that I watched. Well, the, before the one I watched today. I watched actually two of her videos today because I did the crocheted um, washcloth and I, I made mine just a little bit smaller, but this is the washcloth that she did. Isn't it? It's, it's so cute. I made it this size because it'll fit the kids. The kids will like this. It was a really, really easy pattern to follow. And I used, and I used the, this came from Walmart. They both came from Walmart. They used to be really huge. The, um, I have another one of these white ones. But I thought I better use up that. And this was partial of one. And I thought, well, I'll use this color. 
the kids like this color. It'll go for a boy or a girl because it's got purple in it and it's got green in it and so either one will like it. So depending on which child wants to use it. But I'm loving her stuff that she's making. Now she showed today she made a little purse for her mother. mother. Yeah, for her mother for Mother's Day. And it's adorable. It's one of those little old-fashioned purses that you have the little top that you twist. My mother used to have one of those. I used to have one of those. They are so nifty. It's a little change purse. And um, she's going to make more for she's her sisters. Make more. Yeah, and I had suggested, because she's going to put a charm on them, and I had suggested in my comment that if you know, you can't find a charm that you like. If you have old earrings, old dangle earrings, the dangle would make a nice little charm. And they would be something from something old with something new. <laughs> I think you're getting married now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, I want to show you those videos. They're going to be back probably further in the video. I don't know where they'll be. Oh, I don't know. You'll see them when you see them. So I'm going to try to sneak them in there. So I hope you enjoy and had a great day. And I will talk to you all again tomorrow. Bye-bye.